What's happening everyone, my name is Alex and welcome back. Well, you may have noticed that I haven't posted as many videos over the past 3-4 days and that's mostly because I got this. So this is an RC car made by VL Toys and it's got a very uninspiring name, it's called a 12428. So you can buy this for around 60 to 80 dollars but like anything else it really depends where you buy it from. Even though this is not the cheapest RC car out there it offers a lot of entertainment for that price so I've been playing with this non-stop for the past 4 days. So this comes in a fairly big box and inside the box you're gonna find the car itself, you're also gonna find the remote control and the user manual. The user manual is gonna be very useful mostly when you're gonna start breaking this because it's made out of plastic and you're gonna abuse it and eventually something will break so definitely useful whenever you're gonna be looking for replacement parts. The remote control is very tiny compared to the car itself and it's also made out of this cheap looking plastic so whenever you're holding the remote control in your hand it doesn't feel um, that premium but considering that you only pay like 60 bucks for the entire thing I think it's um, normal. As for the range you can control the car up to 50 meters away from you but at that distance the car is kind of far and you can barely see it anyway so I think it's more than enough. And I almost forgot that to get a power adapter so you can actually charge um, the battery. So this car has a 7.4 volt uh, 1500 milliamp LiPo battery but using that charger to charge the battery takes about 4 hours and a half so very very slow. So I do recommend buying another charger because I have um, another one from another car and it only takes about an hour and 20 minutes, an hour and a half um, to charge it to that charger. Now since we are talking about the battery you can play for around 15 to 20 minutes, it really depends where you drive or what you drive and so on, so you can get about 15 to 20 minutes um, on one charge. The car itself is fairly big and fairly heavy and uh, we also have all wheel drive, but since we have um, great ground clearance you can basically drive this over anything, so over grass, over rocks, over pretty much anything. The other day I took it over some train tracks and I had an action camera on top of the car and maybe that wasn't the best idea because I ended up scratching my action camera but the car did uh, perform very well over those um, train tracks so very very bumpy. The suspension is very soft on the front and on the back and we also have a lot of moving parts on the front and on the back and since everything or mostly everything is made out of plastic um, I can imagine that over time things will break. On the bright side you can find a whole bunch of um, aftermarket replacement parts for this and uh, most of them are made out of metal so you could upgrade this but again it's gonna get expensive and you may be better off to just buy another one of these um, brand new. We even have 6 LEDs that act as headlights and even though they don't get um, bright enough so you can actually play with this at night they do look very very cool. Now because the suspension is kind of soft and the car is kind of high up it's very easy to tip this over so if you're driving fast and then you turn left or right quickly the car will tip over. Now that makes it fun to play with because you have to learn how to play with it because most RC cars are very close to the ground so they don't actually tip over as easy and that makes this car even much more fun because you have to actually learn how to play with it. I tipped this over countless times and I'm kind of impressed that nothing broke so I only have some scratches um, at the top there just above um, those LEDs but other than that nothing, no scratches or anything like that. So I'm not gonna make this video any longer for 60 to 70 dollars this offers a lot of entertainment and if you have a kid well the kid is gonna wanna go outside so he can play with the car, I actually wanna go outside so I can play with the car so definitely much better than um, watching TV. Now since everything is made out of plastic it will probably end up breaking over time but um, I guess um, you can get replacement parts made out of metal and then you can just um, start replacing parts um, on it and that could be part of the hobby as well. I wish the charger would charge the battery a bit faster because you get like 20 minutes of play time and then you have to like wait for 4 hours which kind of sucks so that is the downside. So I'm gonna let you guys watch um, some more footage that I recorded um, with this car and um, hopefully you enjoyed the video, don't forget to press that like button and I'll see you in the next one, thanks for watching.